Hi there, welcome back to another tutorial here on the Nice Hour channel. Today we are going to take a look at creating this modern vanity area. Before we start, don't forget to like the video and share it with your friends. It really keeps me going. Now let's jump in. So as you see, there is a picture of a modern vanity. Let's start creating that. First, let's create a stone panel. Use rectangle tool draw a rectangle by 30 comma 250 right let me extrude it use push pull tool and extrude it by 5 cm right select all and make it component Click on create, right? And also this wooden panel. Again, use rectangle tool. Draw a rectangle right here by 100, 250. Like this. Now let me Take a copy of this stone panel for right, right here. Use Philip tool and move it to the middle of the wooden panel. Press Ctrl to take a copy like this. Now. Create a hole for line light. Right here. Now select the wooden panel and let me scale it up to here. Hold the control to scale from two sides. And also let me extrude a little bit for example by one centimeter select all make it group so now for creating wooden panel as you see this wooden panel made from uh, vertical lowers and we have two methods for creating by hand and by plugging and you know by plugging is much better than work by hand because sometimes maybe you don't have any plugin so you should know what to do we will work both of method so first let's create the wooden panel without using any plugin let's create one of the lowers for example by three centimeter and let me extrude it, for example, by one centimeter. Select all and make it component. Don't forget to make it component, it's so important. And now use move tool and move it here. Let me lock the axis, move it right here. Now Again, move it here, press Ctrl to take a copy of that. Up to here, lock the axis. Now just divide it by any number. For example, divide it by 30, divide it by 20, divide it by 28. I think it's good. This is good. So, this was the hand method, right? Now, let's, let me delete them. Now, let's use the plugin method. Go to inside of that, take a copy of this surface. Go out from the group. Now, go to edit menu and use paste in place. 
pixel then use 1001 bit tools plugin with uh, this option create vertical lowers click on it so as you can see there is a window create vertical lowers and also we can determine the detail depth of that one centimeter thickness three centimeter spacing between them four centimeter and zero angle and also here choose front and just click on create lowers like this this is the second method and this is much better if you have this plugin and also if you don't have this plugin you can find it uh, on our website nicetowers.com i have shared its link in description so now let's create the vanity again use rectangle tool draw a rectangle right here by 20 centimeter and also let me extrude it by 30 centimeter and now select all make it group and also move it up by 75 centimeter and also move it back up to here like this and here let's change something here three centimeter and extrude it a little bit more like this here we have a vanity and also let's create a hole for vanity right here let me move it here now it's good extrude it up to here select this surface use a scale tool we can scale it a little bit hold the control key we can scale it like this so now let's create this wooden box right here again create another rectangle by 15 centimeter and also extrude by 30 centimeter select all make it group and move it back to up to here now let's move it up uh, here like this and also it has two drawer let's create them Thirteen, for example and also take a copy of this edge up to here and divide it by two now just use offset tool take an offset by for example point 15 and here too here too 
now extrude here and also here like this it's ready now let's create uh, this mirror decorative mirror how we can create them just draw a rectangle like this and also fill up the corners use arc tool and fill up the corners here and also here let me move it here now try again and extrude it by 1.6 take an offset of that for lighting select all make it component click on create now let me mirror it and also use move tool rotate it 45 and let me move it back up to here like this and also a little bit down so now take another copy of that like this another copy of that here and a little bit here like this so now how we can cut the additional area just draw a rectangle right here from let me start from this corner up to here make it group go to inside of that take an offset and delete this area and now extrude it like this extrude it then let me move it here to see better let me move it by a clear distance for example 300 centimeter and also select this mirror and also again move by 300 centimeter like this now first select this mirror use solid tools with union option make them a single group now these are a single group and also we have another group right here again use solid tools with subtract first select the cube right then the mirror like this as you see we we cut them now move it back by 300 centimeter like this 
And guys, if you want to have this model for free, you can download it from nysorplus.com. I have shared its link in description. I hope this tutorial was useful and helpful for you. For more tutorials, please subscribe to our YouTube channel if you haven't already. Don't forget to like the video and share it with your friends.